What's up guys, we're back here, and we are going back into some more Don't Starve Together. Uh, trying to figure out- oh, I have messed that pile too, now too. Um, last time, uh, we just kind of ran around, we made the lantern, explored our caves a little bit. Speaking of which, actually, do. Uh, how do I refill? Add fuel. So, it's like 20% per, I like that. And we might want to go get some more of these. I'm also trying to get our food popped up a little bit. Um, we had explored a little bit of the lower part of the map, uh, which I have also since walked around. I grabbed a few more. I want to dry some more of these. They are going bad quickly. I also had went around um, and picked up some more lightning bugs last night. I um, won't we'll keep this meatball on us. Another one on us today as we run around um, so we can continue to light up our base here um, it is getting cold though um, we need to make another yeah as you can kind of tell we need to make another winter hat if possible we are getting fairly low I don't know if we have the stuff to make it we have enough for a top hat which we should do eventually do I have more beefalo wool I think I do yeah let's go ahead and do that let's make another hat Keep on us, because ours is at 20% here. Alright, do that. Um, I guess for now, let's put up some stuff too. We are carrying a lot of nonsense. Um, I'm just going to drop this here. It's not winter. Don't have to worry about it. Also getting super nighttime again. Um, days are just never long enough. Uh, I am going to throw in some extra stone here. This is kind of our resource chest. I throw the niter up. But I want to explore the caves and having our lantern now. I'm kind of okay to do so. Um, there's plenty of stuff that we need. Um, more light bulbs for one. Um, but also just to explore that area. I want to find some rabbits. Would be super cool. Um, and I think... I don't know if it's actually warmer down there specifically. Um, but it cannot hurt to um, find out. I hope the bats are... At least not terrorizing this area too much. Uh, we never made new traps here. Oh, they are, but we can, I think, just pass right by them. Back down to the sinkhole. Hopefully, it won't be too bad down here. Um, but we'll, we'll grab some more light bulbs right off the bat and explore. And should be able to um, keep up what we're doing here with the lantern. Grab this out. Um... So one light bulb is 20%. Gotta keep that in mind um, for what we're doing here. It is soups dark. We also could grab more fireflies while we're down here, but that requires us to like drop the lantern, pick it back up, and it does get pretty old pretty quickly. That doesn't sound good. What is that? Oh, is it Haven? Collapsation? Yep. Yeah. Woohoo! Do not hit me, I think. Ow. I don't know how much damage these do. Okay. A few few couple rocks. I don't know how much that really did to us, but I don't think it was enough to have ran away. I don't spend a lot of time in the cave, so I'm not I wasn't sure if um that was that dangerous. Um but also I found out I, I was like panicking last time thinking Klops was here because uh, I wasn't sure what the noise was. I'm pretty sure the loud crunching noise, uh, and you guys might know better than me, um, was the sound you just make in snow. It's just like incredibly loud, like incredibly unbelievably loud. Um, and I tried turning down the ambient sounds and seeing if that would help. Um, it didn't really feel like it did, but um, I, I tested it a little bit like on and off trying different things to see if that's what I felt like was making the noise. So, and I, that was my conclusion I came to. All right, the green biome here, which I kind of like. Um, I would like to set up like a, a middle base here, like down here with the science machine, all that kind of stuff. Um, and we have enough materials to do so. I just kind of wanted it to be somewhere more interesting. Uh, I know you're hungry. We got a meatball here. Go ahead and eat. Um, I don't know that we will find that immediately. 
Uh, I think right now we're just kind of exploring. But kind of rabbits are on the agenda. Another good field of these glow berries or light bulbs. Why I call them glow berries? Um, because, yeah, we're not. You know, we don't have that many. I don't know if these ferns really do anything uh, for us specifically. Uh, that's something to keep in mind. Also, for summer, I don't know if we want to spend most of our time down in the caves. I think that keeps you cooler. Um, and you don't have to deal with the summer boss who like does nonsense to the upper to the upper surface. So could be an idea. Something I've not done is a cave base, but it seems like the areas, at least by our portal or our uh, spawn in down here, are at least hospitable. Does it see? Okay, here we go. Nice to see these. We need to collect some while we're here. Um, keep enough fuel for our lantern to make it worth our time. Any carrots. Um, I don't know if you can pick these up. I meant to bring a shovel. Can I craft one? Can you actually move these around? Let's see. Can I dig this? No, you cannot. So we do need to find an area that's going to have uh, more of these light bulbs. The, our like spawn in only has a handful and they're very good for different things all right, so here's mushies continue I want to see if I can find also maybe some ruin areas uh, these are the bad spiders yeah look at these nonsensicals I don't know if they have anything that we specifically need that they're gonna come and try to mess with us oh and it's getting cold again that's not good. Uh, we need to make a campfire. Get back towards our little base over here. Uh, or I could just... This for now. Just enough to warm up. Okay. Let our temperature rise up. Actually, go ahead and... Drop this here for a second. Let it heat up from the ambient heat here. Um, once it gets warm, we'll pick it up and continue around. Uh... And our hat is at 20. Okay, there we go. Alright. That should do it. I'm not too worried. Oh. Big wet tentacle. I don't know what that's... I know that's like... You can do something with this. I'm not sure what that is specifically. Um, if anyone knows and would like to let me know. That would be awesome. But I think you can hit it and it causes... Earthquakes. And like drops materials for us. That's kind of cool. I'm, I'm, my main goal is rabbits, which I think they will mess me up if I'm if I'm if I'm correct because I'm carrying meatballs, they will be not nice to me. But I can quickly eat those, fix that problem. I think we mostly have mush islands, and we mostly have plains down here currently. I don't know if there's like a a huge field of light bulbs you can find. That seems like something that'd be nice. Uh, just to keep our lantern going. Um, that way we know we can make like light bulb runs. Because you also, I think they're the one of the best materials to use for rot. If I'm uh, not mistaken. They expire the fastest or rot the fastest. So that could be a thing. I also like, I definitely want to grab these triples when I see them. They will be the most useful. To me specifically. But it might be one of those things where we need to, on the surface, go dig another hole. Um, I know there's another cave down by our base. Uh, spiders down here. Um, but I don't want to open that one and let more... Let bats in that are that close. So we might have to travel a little bit around. Uh, I can't remember if there's another sinkhole where some other ones are at. Light bulb. We'll just gather it. Well, but... No, having this lantern is a game changer for me. Because there's... Like, a lot you can do just, like, walking around and exploring that I've neglected. Having this makes me feel much safer to do so. It makes the nights feel a little less wasted. But you do burn through more food. You're, you're not doing a lot of, like, as much cleanup, I guess, in your base. But don't start. I feel like there's only so much you can do. You can't make, like, a ton of chests. And, you know, as long as you have, like, I have 19 wood on I me. Mean, I haven't really done too too much to like like harvesting and gathering 
uh, adventure, so... I don't know. I haven't quite found the middle, but I think this is the full edge. I don't think there's another path off of here. To map it out. That way we can, at the end of today, kind of open our map and see where we should be exploring left. Because this is kind of like bad spider town, but you guys could t let me know if there's a use to like farming these spiders. Like, do they have a higher chance to drop silk? Is there like an additional item that I'm not considering that they drop? All good things that would help me. Don't play. But I've been playing it more. I, I mean, we are doing okay this time. Okay. Ow! Oh, they spit at you. I didn't know that. Okay, maybe I should buy some healing items. Um, I didn't bring any of our um, fried, like, small jerky because I didn't know we would need it that bad. Alright, let's try to get out of here. Um, I think we kind of mapped out this area fairly well. Look at the map. Yeah, and it looks like we need to be going more. Oh, you're hungry. Okay. Don't scare me like that. Don't talk unless spoken to. Um. <laughs> We need it looks like to go more south and west over here. Uh, seems to be a little bit better for us. Go up and over. It looks like we're progressing to another day. I do want to at some point check out our sanity is going down. I wonder if it's because we're hungry. Okay, no, it's just probably just because we're in the caves. Um, but we have some jerky. I'm not too too concerned about the sanity. Um, I think we can heal that pretty quickly if we need to. Uh, our thermal stone is cold. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Uh, we might want to make a campfire. So it seems like where we're at here is the most hospitable. It's all green. Connecting. I don't like how this all branches. It makes it very difficult to decide the best path to be taking. But I feel like our upper world is very similar to this, where it's very, um,. I described it last time. Like rib bone esque. I hear more spiders. Not what I want to hear specifically. Okay. Here. Oh, here we go. Continuing around. And ending path. Alright, we did a lot of exploring here. Ooh, getting cold again. Don't really want to start another like localized fire. Go ahead and put. This seems like a nice enough area. Let's put a fire pit down here and see what we can do. Make it try to heat up our thermal stone. I'm not like too disappointed in this area. Go ahead and drop a science machine down. And unequip this for a minute. Um, go ahead and refuel this here. Now, the only thing that I guess keep in mind is it looks like your sanity constantly drops in the caves. So, you, we can't live here. Well, we could live here indefinitely, but we gotta figure out ways, I guess, to mitigate that. Um, kind of make that usable. Cut down some trees. Oh, I like that echo. I've never cut down trees down here. Oh, I noticed it. We do get pine cones, right? Yeah. We should... Plant some more right nearby. I guess there also could be an argument to making um, some different uh, light sources down here, so you don't have to keep burning through your wooden stuff. But I guess that's why you'd build an area with like a lot of glow bulbs. But I still, me personally, I still don't quite understand uh, when they are, are active and when they're not active. Okay, so here. Where are you at hand? Not doing this today. Get out of here. Thank you. Um, I'm not sure when they are and are not active for the glow berries or the light bulbs. I keep calling them glow berries. I don't know D and D term that I'm just like dumbing and not remembering. Okay. Grab this. I'm pretty happy with this. Good little area. It's not like right inside the portal, but it's like right off to the side. I think our entrance is right here. 
Yep. Alright, let's head back up. Actually, this is not our entrance. Eat. Sure. I thought it was right here somewhere. Map. Oh yeah, it's um, it's a little bit more north. Oh, it's right there. Apparently, I'm just dumb and missed it. Let's head back up. See how we're doing. Um, craft some more stuff. Make sure nothing's too crazy up here. Um, we got the glow bulbs I kind of was liking. Our pigs are out. Hello, pigs. Are you okay? You're sleeping, apparently. Uh, plenty of, like, bat stuff and everything's super frozen right now. Also, our sanity is looking quite bad. Oh, that trap disappeared. Uh, I don't want to fight these spiders if I don't have to. I'm just going to harvest some of my stuff here. Come on, spiders. Pigs. Yep, go fight them if you want to. I would like the meat from all this. Oh yeah, there's no way. Maybe from him? Okay. Oh, he eats the big meat. <laughs> Any pig- oh. Oh, he already ate it. Yeah, I need more pigs over here if we're gonna continue this. He just killed himself. I'm not fighting you. I don't feel like fighting any warrior fighters. I got a little bit more guano. I guess that's fine. I can collect some more. This has been my main source of, like, fertilizer here. But it doesn't matter because it's winter. Alright, let's continue back down. It is pretty cold. Did I forget my thermos? No, I got my thermos. In my bag. So I can remember where it's at. Uh, I haven't seen any... The walrus man. I don't know where he's at. These are all dried. All looking good. I don't know, is there something new I should be making? Walls. Or a garden hill. Not necessary. Um, let's harvest this. Make another meatball while I'm here. Try to put up some stuff. Um, maybe look around a little bit more. Uh, we kind of need to figure out... We need to eat these. These are going to be important, so let's go ahead and... Yeah, it's starting to turn a little bit, I know. Eat a bunch of them. I don't want to waste them anymore, so. Right. Those we eat. Ah. Alright, so our, our winter food supply is not doing great. Uh, throw our light bulbs in here. Our lantern's pretty full. Go ahead and this stuff up. Guano in here. Um, I want to put these up, but I just don't know where. I don't have any space in either one of these chests. Uh, okay. Winter hats at seven. Do I have anything in Chester? Yeah. No, he's in. Okay, let's continue down. I haven't explored fully to the left side over here. Penguins. I really want these eggs. It would also be very nice. If we get desperate for food, it might be one of the kind of things we turn to. Um, we still can make meatballs, so I'm not too worried. We just don't have as good of sanity gain from them as we do from some of the other stuff. It is not a full moon yet, but I did want to keep an eye on that idea. Uh, our sanity is looking a little bit better. Um, hopefully not being down in the caves will also help that. I do have torches in case I need to light a quick warm fire. Um, this looks like it must be like a hound area, yeah. I do want some like hound teeth and bone shards. Humble weed. Rope. Oh, and beef loaf fur. And a fern. Uh, these things are always fun to get. Um, I always like the jackpot surprise element of it. Also, this is the dragonfly desert. So, I guess. I don't know. And again, maybe one of you guys, yeah, there's dragonfly. Um, and you guys can correct me if I'm very wrong on this. Will Klops fight Dragonfly? Spooky. I can't break that down. Uh, I don't know that, but I do know Cactus is apparently pretty good for food. I don't know what you make out of it, um, but we can figure it out. Ooh, hound's teeth. That's what I was kind of wanting. Um, we need more hound traps, so I don't want to adventure too far in here because if I get a bunch of hounds, it's going to be not fun. 
but like skirting the edge here I don't know if another biome is going to connect to this that's kind of what I'm afraid of also there's my keep this where I know where it's at um, there's my light source and drop this here let's go ahead and gather some of the stuff while we're waiting I'm kind of okay getting more stone oh equip that one. not what I wanted uh, yeah, I gotta remember to be careful, because I'm bad to dark petals. I don't want to do that, I don't think. Uh, I'm bad to select off of this, then it's bad for your, bad for your sanity. Okay, let's put this back down. There's like three, two or three boulders, because I'd like to put some walling around our base. I don't know, actually, if that matters too, too much. I think it ends up... Uh, being easily destroyed, but if it can kind of keep hounds off of us for a little bit and allow us to like move away from our base in such a way, it could be worth it. All right, I need to come pick this up. It's gonna go right here. Get this up here. <laughs> that two seconds is like the scariest part. I need to walk around here. There looks like another island to our um, left over there. Also, spiders somewhere. Not sure where. Now I'm kind of hoping these tumble. Well, I'm apparently getting closer. Yeah, these tumbleweeds can give us. Stop this here. I don't know where the spider's at. Um, trinkets we can give to the pig king. Okay, we're full on that too. Um, what do I not need? I guess I can eat these berries. Okay. Um, we also need a log suit eventually. I don't know where these spiders are really at. Apparently we're getting closer though. Um, fern, I can just eat. I don't see them, but I don't really want to see them. Yeah, plenty of tumbleweeds. I also like that, yep, two garden gnomes here. Okay. Um, I guess let's carry this back and go trade with this man. Something I've not really done much of, so. Kind of okay to try it. We also need to watch. We didn't bring any light bulbs on us, but that's fine. Okay. Yeah, this is a good little collection area. It's really close to home and really close to the Pig King, which is kind of what we want to see here. Free gold, which means I probably should and can easily invest in golden tools. Uh, I've kind of steered away from it because in my brain, I don't know how much the like difference in durability is and I don't want to spend like a ton of time harvesting stuff however this is a great way to do so is you give him trink if I remember right you give him trinkets and he gives you stuff drop this here drop this here head back home and yeah, we're getting cold so it's a good time to be doing that unquip eat up yeah I don't want to open this Ooh, our sanity's looking a little, a little worse for wear. This, eat it, my boy. Go ahead and just heat this baby up. Get warm. Throw this thing down. Okay. Store this. This is bone shards. I'm not sure what these are for. What do these do? Can I convert these into something? They're like a resource, wax paper, beeswax, thick fur, fossil fragments. Don't know if those are any good for anything. Succulent, summer plant. Yeah, I don't see any here. I think some of this is just from the modded stuff, yeah. Gnomes and all that kind of stuff. I can make one of these. Cool. Put this up in here. Um, let's go ahead and I'm pretty okay with making another chest here. Let's refine some stuff Also, we've maxed out on our um, Brass fiber which is great so we can start storing some more in here I'm happy about that and I think we maxed out on twigs yep. Start gathering the extras. Uh, I like to keep a stack on me though. Uh, oh our hat's gone See, Good thing we made another one um, once we run out on tools, I want to go ahead, actually, and craft some of these gold ones, what I need. 
Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. And we'll leave our other one here. So this axe can be left here for emergencies. Play him up here. Uh, I don't need... This shovel's 100%, but I'll leave it up here in case I need it. Same with my pickaxe. Go ahead and invest in gold version. Shovel? I don't know that you can get a golden spear. Okay. Try to get my inventory looking better. I don't need a golden hoe. That one I don't think is necessary. And there we go. That looks a lot nicer. Bone charge I don't have here, so I do need to invest in another chest. Got three of these. And this is just good also for my character's sanity. So it's getting a little lower. I would build a chest to my chest pile. Let's go right here. Seems like a good spot. Eventually, I'll organize these in a different manner. And technically, I could use Chester as another chest. But, um, I like him just to sit there and be a good boy. We also should throw these spider eggs up there. Because I would like to keep them. There's probably some kind of good, like, better farm I could be doing with these spiders and these pigs. Um, than just letting them all get murdercated. Because I'm not really benefiting from the death of the pig, specifically. But, it's a start for now. And this here. I also want to remove these. And one thing I wish about the gold tools is I know they're better. Um, but I wish they actually chop stuff down faster. But, alas, I don't think they do. Back over here. Um, I want to plant these away from here. I want to be able to see where these traps are in a pinch so when we run up here so i want to clear out actually a couple more of these and the wood's good since we just used a bunch okay and i want to remove those stumps boom it's over like this yeah i think that's one thing i think would be a cool mod for don't starve is a more minecraft style um like bar where you can scroll through stuff instead of having to like equip and unequip it. That way you can like easily use it. Woohoo! Hello, my friend. Um, we should make some more spider traps eventually. Meat, yeah. Refresher stock. Um, because we aren't uh, taking advantage of it, but I think we our silk supply is good right now. If anything, we should be trying to leverage it a little bit more to make. To like do some fishing. I know we talked about it. I don't know if the lobsters are as active around the winter time or if they even care. So that's one thing we should consider. Throw this in here. Yeah, this is spoiling fast. Go ahead and dry a bunch more of this. Okay. And we actually probably should, just to keep our stores high, um, go get some more meat. Eight more of these. I don't know if I what I'll be using this for, but it does. It does help our hunger pretty good, so, I mean, it's, I guess, good to keep for something. I probably can look up what uses for monster jerky. I don't know if you can safely give it to pigs. Actually, we need to go back in nighttime. All right. And our base is looking pretty slick. I'm going to equip this. I'm going to go ahead and toss another one. And another one. I think... This one's fine right here. Can I go ahead and capture... Where's my bug now? Go ahead and catch this one. Go ahead and release him, like, up here. This is looking marvelous. This is the kind of thing I wanted uh, when I was doing this. And then maybe we'll put stone walls across the top here once we get some more fireflies. It, it takes time to get those, though. But we, we ha we've been doing really well on our silk front, and I'm actually going to go and capture all three of these. Um, so we have been able to like flex this resource. All four of these actually. And that'll be the end of our net. But, um, that's fine with me. But, but a little bit dark right here. Yep, I know it's dark. I'm going to put one right here. 
we go, and then maybe one right. Yep, you're, we're, we're, get, we're getting lit up. Yeah, they, they go out when you like walk past them, but... Want one more like right. Dark. I'm trying to get it like in the right place. And it, it comes up and then goes away. Right here. There we go. That should do it for now. Pretty good little lit up area. I can see we can wall the back off so hounds like can't come straight through our base. I think will be the right plan. Let's go ahead and store so we don't drop there. Yes, yeah. I'm pretty happy. Let's pick up the beard here. Eventually, we need to get a flingomatic um, for these farms. Actually, might be something worth at least looking into. And we need a hat. Uh, uh, yeah, the magical one. Uh, magic, we haven't even looked into this. We need a Presta Hatitator. Then a Shadow Manipulator. Hat we can actually do pretty easily. That way we can also do a Me Effigy. Pretty, pretty good. And Flute, all that kind of stuff. But, actually I think we are pretty good here. Uh, I think we're gonna wrap up here. I might go through and cut down some more trees. Do a little bit more on that side so we can get some more logs. I want to continue getting some pigs going. Um, actually, we'll play one more round, of, uh, one more day. Because um, I actually want to see if Blommer is going to come back tonight. I think it's getting close to a full moon. And that's one thing we would really enjoy having. Also, our food is looking terrible, but... Not help that too much. I mean, I could make another meatball, but I should have done that before I left. Oh well, we'll probably find some food. We're gonna go to the west here, um, and carrying food that's all swamp area. So I'm not going to be too opposed to not having any food on me when we go over there. It's gonna spoil anyway, and we could pick up some fish, so. which would also be very good. Um, the merman drop fish. Go. Yeah, I've cut down trees through here before and not, not pretty fight it up. Let's go ahead and re-equip my thing. Move this, move this while we walk. I think the west we haven't explored as much. There's a lot of mandrakes over here, which I don't remember. There's a way to like pick them up without them completely wrecking your brain. Um, I will have to look that up. I don't remember specifically. And we also, ooh, hello my friend. You are actually... Your house is a prime target for me. Sorry. I don't want to club him. <laughs> so... Okay. Oh my gosh, yeah. Sorry, friend. I did take your house and leave. And I and my sincerest apologies goes out to you and your family, but... I will relocate you. Oh, these are not looking good. No... F and pig butts do not... Explode, so. Hello, fish man. I don't want to deal with you. Oh, I would like to break... Actually, I do not want to break down your houses. So I think you're just going to continuously get pissed off at me if I do. I'm just leaving. There's no pond, so I don't have anything for the fishmen to fight. Which is disappointing. Because um, that usually keeps them off your tail a little bit. No, it is not a full moon. Uh, it looks like we'll have to do that next time. Or it would be the full moon next time. Uh, ow. Ooh. Guys. Oh, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I almost got quap again. Let's head back. Our health is bad. Uh, coming in here with 32 health might not have been the best strategy, but we can easily leave. They might follow us just a little bit, but I can avoid most of these monsters. Okay. Yep. Fight, fight them. I do need to come in here and collect stuff though. Would be very good. Because there's continuously fighting. Free fish. Also the dark scale stuff. I don't know what it's called. From the tentacles. It is a gray creature. Yeah. But we need health. Um, I don't know if there's any... You, like any way to get ash easily from here. No, these aren't burnt. These are just dead. Also, our sanity is plummeting, so. Let's head back. 
get out of this bad, bad forest. Let's get some food going. I could do a man. Oh, no, is that a carrot or a mandrake? Talking carrot. They don't even say mandrake. I didn't even realize that. I don't think I've really messed with the mandrakes much, though. But I know you pick them up, they put you to sleep. Do a couple other, like, nonsense things. Or oh, we're gonna start taking health damage if we can't get the food. Bone! I should feed this bird if I can. I wonder if I can feed them some of this bad food. Uh, let's go ahead and eat carrot. Three. Let's cook a meatball. This stuff's going back. Can I feed this to the, the bird? Yeah, what's it do if I give you it? Give this to you. Oh, it drops eggs. Okay. Oh, I don't want this. Go over here. I want to pick up this. Okay, that works. Get this meatball in us. Yeah, let's go ahead and start giving this to the bird. And at least recycle it for egg. Um, and we will continuously um, turn some of it into monster to monster meat or into uh, monster jerky. We'll do down to four. Yeah, because these are about done. So I forgot you could do this, honestly. Because if you give him like seeds and stuff, he gives like a. Uh, a little bit of guano. Oh, we need to make a fire too. Okay. Um, but if you give him full meat, he gives you egg. And egg is pretty good. Alright, let's slap these in the ice box. I don't. Oh, I hear you, hand of nonsense. Get out of here. Now that I have a lantern, you are not as scary. Oh, let's actually throw a whole another thing here. Um, let's go ahead and grab these. I'm liking it. And I like that these monster jerkies are just... I think we'll just use these as bird food for dire, more dire straits as we fill it up and we will dry the rest of these. Because, yeah, those last a while. Oh, I was confused on what that noise was. That is the... The... Uh, Catman. Not Catman. I don't think I did that. Get out of here. I just didn't hang them. Uh, drop and dry... Dry. Is he killing my my lightning bugs? If so, I'm gonna be kind of annoyed at him. Try on the rack. Try on the track. Yeah. I feel like I should kill him. I don't know what what the advantage of keeping him is. Uh, also, while we wait here, look. What is a good use for egg? We can make. Uh, bacon and eggs. So any one and a half meat and one and a half egg. Waffles. You need butter and stuff. Pierogi is meat and fruit. Can I actually use this? Yep. And if I do this, that does get pierogies. And that's 40 health. There we go. That's... I can do that. We just need more veggie. And that will help our health situation tremendously. Because that'll be 80 health right there. I like it because we have, so once we get back to like spring or summer, um, we should be able to, oh yeah, look at this. Dish of champions, 40 health. Oh, that's, our health hasn't looked that good in a while. <laughs> we have been really roughing it. Um, structures, how much do I need for another pig house? I need two more pig butt. Do I have two pig butt on me? I have five pig butt. So I can make actually, it's four per. I'm a couple short actually. Two, three, four. Right. Take house. What else do I need? One stone and two wood. Or two boards. Give them another fighting chance. The goal is for them to be stronger um, than the spiders. Or at least strong enough where um, they don't instantly get wrecked. <laughs> Because <laughs> that's what's happening now. Um, and then we will supplement their forces eventually with rabbits. Um, and then we will have our small little enclave up here. Okay, where are they at? Could be right here. Ooh, our energy's going up because it's daytime. 
Nice. Where are my pig houses? I feel like I passed them already. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, they're more right, I guess. Okay. That's not. Oh, that's not. That's not good. That's very bad, actually. Uh. My friend. I don't. You're. Me. No. Okay. That's Klops. <laughs> I, I knew I was going to run him kind of this way. Uh, to fight Spider-Man, but he is just decimate. This he is way too close to my base. Okay, this is for next episode. We will deal with this. I'm probably going to jump off soon. Um, I have no way to deal with this man. Hello. Yeah, come on, run after me. I want to lead him deeper into this area, so he can fight spiders. That aren't like the main source of what we're doing. Alright, come on. These are at least level 3 spiders. Like this, these dens, I don't have feelings for. Okay. And then you guys. My clops lost interest. Quicker than I expected, honestly. Where did he go? Hello. Hi. Oh, I think he will kill me pretty quickly because I have no armor too. I want to lead him through here and have the spiders mess him up. Wander in. Come on, keep wandering over. Come on. Wander more. Alright. There we go. Attack Clops. Alright. I think he will decimate them very easily. Yeah. But I can leave him now. He won't follow me. Um, we probably lost our spider farm area. Well, more than likely. These tooth traps are useless here. Um, that sucks we lost most of our houses though. Because that's not nearly enough stuff. We need to make like an actual pig area where we can farm. We should keep one pig like closer so we can continuously farm and then do it from that. Um, because, yeah, they were not strong enough to keep up with anything. But, alright. We'll figure out Clops next time. I don't have the brain power to do it today. Also, we've been going for almost an hour. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit the like button. Or, subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.